Hey everyone, it's Brennan the Paleo Dude, out fossil hunting at one of my favorite sites in BC, in Princeton. And uh, today I found some really spectacular finds that I'd like to share with you guys. So, I'm going to start off with one of the most coolest things that I found. And it's the body of a bowfin fish. Now these are a freshwater uh, long-bodied fish with very interesting scales. The scales on bowfins have a very circular um, pattern, kind of like rings on a tree. I've never found a fish like this before at a site. Uh, usually they're very small fish or uh, fragmented medium-sized ones, but this was quite the surprise. I've even got um, part of, I believe, the head. It's got a nice uh, orangey contrast on this kind of purplish, brownish rock. So that was a spectacular find for today. One of the um, top things. And uh, the second most coolest thing that I found was a water strider. So I've got both halves of it. The very distinct legs and body. And I even found a juvenile water strider. So a really tiny baby one. It's kind of hard to see. I don't know if the camera will focus in on it. So right there. very small. Surprised I saw it. Uh, some other things you can find at the site are metasequoia and sweet ferns. So sweet ferns are a type of plant. They're not actually a uh, fern. They're more of a low um, type of brush plant, kind of like a bush. And here are sequoia and metasequoia. It's a very good example of it. A very detailed piece. Not sure if it focused in or not. Um, and at this site, there are plentiful insects, a uh, large abundance of uh, March flies and um, frog hoppers, which I'll show you in a sec. I just gotta grab the specimens. So this guy is a March fly. They've got very distinctive wings, and they're one of the most common fossils at the site. Another fossil um, insect are frog hopper wings. I've never personally found a body of these guys, usually just the wings, which have a zebra-like pattern along the length of them. And then this is a wing of an insect. I'm not sure if this is a, uh, a crane fly or a damsel fly, but it's um, a large winged insect wing. Let's see you. Fossils from the site range in color as um, the rock differs from layer to layer. So you can get very exquisite uh, preservation, like this guy, this uh, red metasequoia. It's got an orangey reddish hue. And then here's a metasequoia preserved on a, a brown shell with three sprouts coming out of it. Uh, metasequoia are very uh, large trees. And I forgot to mention, this is a Eocene age site, so it's about 50 million years old. It's after the dinosaurs went extinct. Let's see if there's any other specimens worth showing. Here's some other fossil plants found here. Sticks. I can't remember the name of that guy. It's another pine plant. Yeah, so it's a very abundant um, site, and I was lucky enough to find these cool specimens today. Um, the last fossil I'm going to show, to get both sides for you. So these are bowfin scales and ribs. Uh, usually they're the same color as the rock, but this was very interesting how they um, preserved white. Uh, I believe that's the backbone. There's uh, scales of a bowfin, and these are the ribs. So it's a scattered specimen. So. Those are most of the specimens that I found today, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, leave a comment and a like, and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more fossil hunting content, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.